This is part of a PhD research project um, run by Brendan O'Neill here at UCD Centre for uh, Experimental Archaeology. It's based on um, excavated remains from a site in Antrim um, called Deer Park Farms. Um, it was a raised rot um, dating from the, the 8th century roundabouts and um, this is one of the structures um, which was excavated there. Uh, it's constructed of wattled uh, hazel uh, which was coppiced and um, probably um, sourced locally. Um, coppicing is a method of ensuring that it grows in straight um, sections so it's easily used as a building material. Um, it's then thatched with heather um, from the soil samples recovered at the site. Um, it, they, they showed um, high levels of heather um, pollen so we could deduce from that that heather was used in the thatching rather than cereal like straw or hay. Other reconstructions have used cereal thatching such as straw um, but this header has proved um, to be much more effective in uh, allowing smoke to, um, to breathe through the house more naturally. Of the remains um, discovered at Deer Park Farms, door jams, a lintel, which is underneath there, and a, a threshold um, were discovered in, intact almost. Uh, the lintel had broken at, at the top, um, and probably due to a hole, which allows the door to pivot. Um, the threshold was found with a, a similar hole at the bottom, a corresponding hole. So from those pieces of evidence we could deduce a hinging mechanism for, for the door, which is wooden pivot and works quite well. The structure is double walled. Some constructions often mention wattle and daub techniques, but there is no archaeological evidence for the use of wattle and daub at Deer Park. Instead, they preferred a double walled um, structure, but in between the walls. It's filled with organic materials such as leaves and ferns and some heather as well and that, that forms uh, an insulation rather than daubing. Um, the, the outer wall comes to about this height uh, whereas the inner wall continues to form the roof inside. It's basically similar to an upturned basket.